Good evening, I'm Holden Absher. Bloomington residents on West Gordon Pike are fighting against tree removal. A resident noticed a mark on a tree just three days before the removal was scheduled to take place. And when you see not only the loss of one tree, you see the loss of hundreds of trees. It's hurtful. County Highway Director Lisa Ridge says residents should have been informed despite not having legal rights to the trees. The removal is part of the larger Fullerton Pike project. Bloomington residents will pay more for wastewater and stormwater next year. The new revenue will help with inflation and infrastructure upgrades. We do have some locations where our sewers can overflow. Uh, we need to do infrastructure work to prevent that from happening in the future. Wastewater fees will increase in two waves. The first will be a 12% hike next month. The second will be a 6% hike in 2025. In total, the average customer will pay about an extra $5.50 per month. After leading the Ivy Tech Bloomington campus for more than nine years, Chancellor Ginny Vaughn will retire in May. I just uh, look forward to hearing all kinds of great things uh, about what this campus will continue to do. During Vaughn's tenure, the campus added programs in automotive technology, biotechnology, and radiation therapy. Ivy Tech hasn't yet named a successor. Now for a quick look at the weather tonight, chance of showers with a low of 36 degrees. Looking ahead at the next five days, sunny this weekend with highs in the low 40s. There's a chance of showers early next week with temperatures in the low 50s. For more local news, go to WTIUnews.org and catch Indiana News Desk Fridays at 6. Have a good night.